Hey, what's going on, good people? It is your boy, and we are back with another video. And to those that are new here, appreciate you tuning in. Yo, we do a lot of photography talk, we do a lot of business talk, and we do a lot of studio owner talk, and we interview some dope people as well. So make sure you stick around, tune in. We got so much in store. I just wanted to come in today and give you a rundown of the weekend and actually show you what we got going on today. So Friday, I had a photo shoot here in studio. Um, we shot on that palette wall right there and the grass wall in the back and the mural in the back. Um, then Saturday, yesterday, uh, we had the unique opportunity of capturing a 70th birthday party. It was a gay couple and they are pretty dope. They had a red carpet with a drag queen hosting it. They had a whole drag show. It was something we've never seen before, but it was pretty dope. We had a great time. Um, more importantly, they had a great time. So our responsibilities at that was to um, interview the folks on the red carpet. Well, one of the drag queens did the interviewing. We just recorded it, right? And then we did the videography for the event as well. Uh, it did not end. Well, we didn't get out of there until about... 10 30 i didn't get to bed till about midnight and my dog was waking me up at five o'clock this morning so yeah a little tired but hey it's time to go right so now i'm going to clear this set and create um our podcast set for our guests that are coming in today we have a podcast episode where the host is going to be interviewing two young black pilots that's right we're talking aviation, baby. So we have two young pilots that are flying in this morning from Ohio to uh, Concord uh, Airport. I think it's Concord Regional Airport. That's about 20 minutes away from our studio. So I'm going to get everything in here set up before they get here. Hopefully I can get over there to the airport and try to get some footage of them uh, arriving. And then we'll come back in here and shoot the podcast episode. All right. So stick with us and see how it goes. So step one is done. I had to clean this floor, get everything out of the way, and now I'm going to set up the set. For this client, we typically choose the set for them. Uh, so I'm going to choose this side. We're going to have a uh, curtain close and everything and then put up like a divider and stuff. It's going to be one host and two guests. Again, it's two young black pilots. I think both of them are under 30. Um, but anyway, so I hope they like this set because if they don't, we have to switch it. <laughs> but they typically do. You know, we've never had them ask us to change sets out after we've already created. So now let's get to putting the set together. So you all see the set right here right now. It's pretty much staged. The only thing is we have to get our mega desk over there and then get the lights in place and set it up. There may be some tweaks from there, but overall, this is how we're going to lay the set out. Um, and I will show you what it looks like real quick. All right. So I only have the uh, blind on the door open so I can see if anybody comes up. Um, three person set. So the two guests will sit right here and share this table with the mics and the host will sit right here with the mic stand. Um, behind the divider, we will put a LED light and we'll probably do like a warm tone color behind it so that it illuminates through the uh, panels. Uh, we'll position this plant here and that uh, plant holder or pot holder after the guests sit down uh, and this one right here we may change a little bit too because here's the thing you never want your plants 
or any decor to be coming out of the top of a person's head. So when they sit down and you see where they're going to land, then you just shift the plant to the side if it's directly behind them. All right. So both this plant and this uh, bench will be like the backdrop as well. I am looking for one more piece. I cannot find it. <laughs> I used it in the shoot on Friday and I don't know where I uh, put it, but that is a vase with a, uh, some feathers in it. So I'm looking for that and I'll put it probably on the floor back here. When I move the mega desk up here, it'll be right there. Definitely want to give a big shout out to Charlotte Podcast Studio and the hospitality, the setup. This stuff is dope. The layout is amazing. Shoot. The energy is great. The energy is great. Yeah. has uh, lifted us up coming yeah. in here. Yeah. So. The, the location from everything from, like, the, like I said, the setup to the location to Shamar and Tay and the company and everything they do here in the studio. It just, it looks great. Like, I. It's very professional. It's very, very professional. professional. Like. I'm you a, trying to start a podcast? I'm a little intimidated. <laughs> you fly back down here. Just yeah, like we could. We this is a, I like the city. I mean, this yeah. is awesome. Yeah, we we seen the city coming in, but um, but now it was dope. Just uh, and it's not too far from the airport we landed at and everything. Mm -hmm. So if any other pilots are out there and need to do a podcast and all that stuff, definitely feel free to fly in the Concord. What's the identifier? Remember? JQF. JQF. Julia Quebec, Quebec. Foxtrot. That make it sound cool too. Yeah, Julia yeah. Quebec Foxtrot. <laughs> And, yeah, and you know, and you heard it on the podcast too that we uh, seen cool jets that was here already. But mm -hmm. just the professionalism of the set studio, the lights, mm -hmm. the ambiance. Um, I'm, as a podcast person and a videographer and a creative, it's it's just cool to see how this goes, and it's inspiring too. So yeah, um, we came in a little late, uh, but it seemed like everybody had Plan A, Plan B, Plan C worked out. Facts. So. Which is, it fit us right in. Which is part of production. Yeah. And somebody's on the other side of it. It's like, all right, yeah. so this is what we're going to do now. But yeah. the team did a great job of adjusting to that. And um, if you need any people to do your podcast in the area or if you're not in the area, um, definitely reach out to Charlotte Podcast Studio. They did a great job. Shout out to them. And um, I need a tutorial on how y'all did all this. Yeah. <laughs> And that, boys and girls, is what we call a wrap. I appreciate y'all tuning in, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace, peace.